action for you coming up. Kevin Harlan here alongside Craig Anthony and Chris Webber. And for the Lakers, Green and Rondo in the backcourt. LeBron and Davis, the incredible forward pair. And it's McGee in at the center. You know, Chris, it seems like every year the NBA gets a little more athletic. Talk about how that aspect of changing. <laughs> it's no more big guys go to that end, little guys go to that end. Now you have to be a skilled basketball player. You have to be able to shoot, dribble, and pass at every position. The, the way of the just the one-sided guy, that is... And George kicks to Beverly. And Leonard has it in the corner. Over James. And Leonard gets it to go. Yeah, and for can go up and get it. And there's the pass to Leonard. Shoots from the high post. That ball's nice feed that time from. Yeah, great momentum for them offensively. Not a problem when that's your first miss of the game. Strong start. Shot up to the by James, and it's sent back by George. Oh, and the jam by Leonard. A big apostrophe or exclamation point, maybe even a question mark. Nailed from three-point land. Pass to George. Back to Leonard. Jacks up a three. The shot's good on the assist by George. Easy night for you. Well, you knew that Kawhi Leonard would be a huge name on the free agency market last summer. Oh, the power on that through down. Wow. Beverly against Rondo. Over in the corner, Green. And again, it's the Lakers from deep. Yeah. Harden getting to the line is genius because he knows how you're guarding him. And basically, you got to stay away from him to guard him because he's so skilled. And by the way, Curry. Looking around. Passes it to McGee. Shoots from 12. Just five to shoot. That's good from Davis on the it's leading by four. George way outside. An absolute bomb from th Rondo passes to Green. Right side Davis. Over Williams. That one a tad offline to the right. Not going to go that time. And the Clippers will come the other way. And the stroke definitely lacking confidence this quarter. Davis against Green. Davis with the bucket. Davis has got a... Here's James. He kicks it to McGee. And the slam dunk by McGee. Well, that's just too easy. Facial. Oh, a bounce to the ounce, Greg? Yeah, showing off the bunny. Williams finds Green, and Green slams it in. And that is a textbook example of how to defend your rim. Well, that's why he's out there right now. In situations like this, he stands tall to... He knows what his job is. Patrol the offensive glass. Yeah, Kevin, second chance opportunity so big in this instance. Yeah. yeah, flew under the radar as a prospect, but came in with a very refined game and was an impact player early on. Has already started to... I thought that one was going to go down. The mid-range jumpers? Oh, man, that's usually a bunny with the deep playing soft like that. And that one's good. Here's Caruso. He's still scoreless so far in this one. The shot's good. Ball forward as well. But, but defensively, I think he's better on the wing. I mean, think about this. In high school, he was only 5'9 as a freshman. Man, did he grow. He has experience on the play. Williams looking over the floor. Pulls it up. And, yep, finally drops after rolling around the... ...and can find a way to get a shot up where others just have to kick it out. The Lakers making a switch here. James is checking. Years ago, he played all 82 games with a deep playoff run. Now he's in his mid-30s. Age does come into question. Father Time is undefeated, but he loved his... Morris against LeBron, and they double up James. Caldwell Pope with a wide open look. Oh, yes, he did. Catching up on the changes for the Clippers. Kawhi Leonard's checked in for Harrell, and it's Patrick Beverly in for Lou Williams. Wasted no time on that one. Who's out there now for the Lakers? JaVale McGee's checked in for Howard. 
Davis comes in for Kyle Kuzma. Rajon Rondo subbed in for Alex Caruso. From the mid-range area, I mean, his jumper has come a long way. On the wing, James lets it go from deep, and it's good coming on the assist by Rajon Rondo. With that last one here tonight. And Leonard has it in the corner. Shoots, and the Clippers getting another bucket right in the lead. Two for one, probably the way to go. Uh, yeah, yeah, I imagine that's what they're thinking. You, you have to maximize the possessions. And they're able to recover. Good man, he's the pass to Davis. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. The Lakers with the rebound. Might take them a little while to find their stride here in the second half. Only one for four so far. They just need with the bounce pass. Let's go. Gets an open look and hits. He's got five lead changes so far. And guys, neither team has been able to pull away. Here's Davis, and it's Davis finishing it off. East. Put that in perspective. Only eight players have ever done that in league history. Throws it up high. Yeah, that's the third bucket in a row from the... Pass to Davis. A fadeaway. And the basket good. A bank shot then. Here's Caruso. He's guarded by Williams. Goes up with the stripe. And he knocks down the jumper. This is the three. Kuzma can't get it to go. The Clippers shooting 38% from the field. A pretty weak showing for them. And that one's good. Leonard. He's got that huge wingspan, and boy, does he use it well on the defensive end. If Davis is within shouting distance of the shooter, time out, time there's a good chance of getting that second chance bucket. They've shown some strength in the paint today. Their work on the board has been impressive. Throws down the second half. He had three at halftime. Pass to Green. A three. Good on the three-point shot. Whichever team you root for, L.A. fans with a lot to celebrate. Here's Howard. Whistle blows. Bucket is good. And he'll have... Inside and attacking the paint. That's an area they have completely dominated. Rajon Rondo is checked in for the Lakers. Jamichael Green, he's checked in. Give them credit, but, but also Kawhi Leonard pushing the levers behind the scenes. He, he wanted another superstar to join him in recruiting Paul George. Who's 43 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Trains it from beyond, passing it around. Here's Davis. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Davis has got hard to replace on a team by just one player. And here's Leonard from three. A three-pointer is right on target. He can't get it to go. The Clippers go the other way with it. Here's Morris. And Morris throws it down. And Morris really rises. James outside. Here's Howard. And the rejection by Zubats. Russo, the pass to Davis. Morris with the ball. Picked up by Davis. Oh, Leonard in position. Hammers the alley-oop through. Enough toughness on the interior. They've got a lot to talk about. And the Clippers making a change here. George is checked in. Oh. And you see the athlete. Impressive sequence that has them fired up. Paul George with the steal. That one goes in. George has got... The Celtics are encouraging their players to take mental health just as serious as their physical. Marcus Morris, brave enough to say that... Leonard against Green. Let's it go. Count it in the Laker lead. has been cut down now. What? Just love watching him operate inside. And pushing it up, here's the Clippers. Leonard's got the ball. McGee with the block. He lets it go. That three off the mark. Rare you'll see him miss such an open look. And Leonard gets it to go. And now to catch up with the fourth member of our crew, Hall of Famer David Aldridge. During that break, Frank Vogel had some real words for his team. It's keep comfortable. Those guys are going to come at us with everything they've got. Let's bring the intensity and stay focused on every possession. Passes it to James. Outside for Davis. Six to shoot. And Davis throws it down. 
control ten. And they've controlled the boards, and that's a big reason why they're controlling the lead. Here's Leonard. Throws it down as the official calls the foul. It may be. George has got five rebounds tonight. Leonard attacking. And what a play. Just snatched out of the air. And that is a big loss for this team. This game's still in the balance, and he's someone they always want in there at crunch time. Hey, watch Braun. The Lakers need to get a shot off here. And another shot. In deep, McGee drops it in. The Lakers, no good. Not enough ticks left on the clock to save them tonight. Oh, well, it's tough, man. When you get to this point in the game, you fall. Now, here's George. From deep three-point range, he can't hit that time. And you could tell he thought he had a little more space, but the defender was right there. Oh, man, did you see him close that gap? What a great job. He made the shooter feel uncomfortable. So the first one drops, and that makes it a seven-point lead. So he gets them both, and it's an eight-point game. For the three... And so the Lakers take the win. Some good competition, but the hometown advantage and their ability to stay focused, I think, made the difference. Yeah, and the, the first step in becoming a good team is your ability to win at home. And they really seem to revel in that opportunity. And, and this is what they came out to do. Wraps it up for Greg Anthony, Chris Weber, and David Aldridge. This is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA. Presented by 2K Sports. So long.